What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the team, Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today we're covering Surging Sparks. I know I'm a little bit late. I haven't technically looked at it, so I don't know what it is. I've only acquired nine cards from this set. I still haven't opened any of... Really, I haven't really opened any packs from the uh, new set either from Surging Sparks, so I have no idea what's in it. Uh, what we're going to do today is a quick recap. First glance at Surging Sparks, see what it's about. Uh, the only cards I can really tell you is Hydrogen, a Tatsugiri, and I, there's a Pikachu that does 300 damage, and that's all I really know. I don't know anything else outside of that, except that Surging Sparks is kind of bad from what it seems like. Uh, so if you have any card that you recommend that I should start testing out, let me know, and I'll definitely look at it. That's the big thing there. Let me know what decks you want to see, and I'll start playing those ASAP. Uh, so we're going to kind of speed through these. Like I said, there's 191 of them. There's a lot of fluff in this set. Uh, so um, you search, you evolve from this Pokemon, and it's like a tour. Flip a coin of each. Okay, so flip a coin of each energy attached to both active Pokemon does six damage for each head. So you could essentially do a ton of damage if you flip a bunch of heads. Uh, no, Executor EX, so no, just have to go with that one, flip some coins. Uh, there's a Durant EX, 190 Grass, when you place Pokemon from your hand onto your bench during the turn, you may discard the top card of your opponent's deck, and Ventral Crush, just 120, and just 31 of each first card your opponent has taken, um, which shows more, or the tag kind of combos with discarding, but it doesn't. Uh, there's a Scatterbug, a Supa, Vivillon, Morlow, Shinodic, once during the turn, it's Pokemon in your act spot. You may make him asleep. Okay. Uh, Delmai, Zarud, Capsicid, Railer, Rapska. Uh, this card's kind of interesting. You have three free cards in your deck. This deck does 200 more damage, but you need three or four of your cards in your deck. That's kind of hard to do. Uh, Wu Chain, uh, there's a Vulpix, Ninetales, Paldalian, Toros, Ho Oh, Castworm, Victini. Uh, Taxi by your Evolution Fire Pokemon do 10 more. Pantsier, Simsier. Larvesta, Volcarona, uh, Oracorio, Sizzlepede, Centiscorch, Foycoco, Crocolor, Skelledridge, print all, effect, print all effects of attacks used by by your opponent's Pokemon. Don't his Pokemon, okay, who cares? Uh, Charcadet, Charcadet, Armor Rouge, Cellar Rouge, and Cellar Rouge GX. I kind of know about this card a little bit, it seems pretty interesting. It does 30, and there's 20 more damage for each energy in the discard pile, so if you can discard a bunch of energies, probably like 17 of them or something like that, you can do like a significant amount of damage. Like, once you have 10 in there, you're doing, what, 230? Uh, so you need like 12, and you do 270. Uh, 17 energies is not like a lot, it's not crazy especially to think about, especially like squawk ability and, and research, stuff like that, and ultra balls and stuff like that, and Mew, draw more cards pretty easy to do so maybe that's a card to look into uh the cool thing about cellar Ridge, it doesn't shuffle back into your deck uh so it could be something you could play uh raging Ameth amethyst does 280 not worth it i don't think uh scovalian we're not a fire and a grass type uh it does 10 and there's seven more damage for each damage counter on this pokemon uh you can combine this with uh the water frost mouth no uh frost last there we go frost last you can combine it and you can do a ton of damage that way uh because you know 7 14 20 20 once you got four damage counters on it doing a lot of damage doing a lot of damage and your grass type too which is sick uh gouging fire okay uh toros mantine feebas mylotic prevent all damage from and effects of attacks uh from your opponent's terror pokemon Prevent all damage from and effects of attacks. So could shut down only like if a pure terror attack. But there's really not any pure terror attacks outside of Terrapicos. But even then, like people like Destinor and stuff like that. Uh, so that's probably not worth it. Uh, Sfeel, Cilio, Walren, uh, Shellos, Cryagonal, Black Kiram EX. Oh my goodness. We got more Black. We got more Kirams. Ice Age 90. Uh, your opponent's next Pokemon was a Dragon Pokemon. It's now paralyzed. Black Frost does 250. And does 32 itself. That's pretty bad. Bruxish, just Quixly, Quaxwell, Quaxwell. Uh, Draw you have five cards in your hand. It's pretty neat. But a stage two is not. Uh, 30 damage from less tax. Iron Bundle. Chin Pow. Uh, discards a stadium and Ice Cycle. Just 120, but pretty bad. And there is the Pikachu X. A pretty, the, the hype card of the set. Uh, it has to, to, Topaz Bolt. Does 300 damage. Discard three energy from this Pokemon. There's a lot of different ways of playing this card right now. People are discussing, you know, what's the best way. I think a Lost Box is probably the most ideal way that I've seen. I'll be able to get 70 Lost Zone and power it up in Mirage Gates. Seems like the best way to do this. Uh, and this Pokemon's full HP and it's knocked out. It has 10 HP. Um, so that's a pretty cool thing. It's like a Focus Ash, but built in. 
Uh, but Topaz Bolt doing 300 is pretty scary. Uh, Magnemite. Magneton is pretty interesting. I think I like this card a lot. I'm uh, just not sure what to partner with. Uh, you may attach up to three basic energy cards. Firm just compiles your light to Pokemon you like. If you use the village, your Pokemon is knocked out, which is cool because it kind of activates like other cards that go with it, like Countercatcher, kind of gain and stuff like that. Maybe like Iona your opponent. Uh, it's pretty neat here. Why accelerate? You also can punish your opponent. Uh, Magnets don't want to care about. A uh, Rotom. Uh, we got a Blitzel, a Strike Up. We got a Stunfisk. And we got a Tapu Koko, Watchreel, Killer Watchreel, Killer Watchreel EX. That's what he looks like. Uh, switch Pokemon one of your bitch Pokemon, attach two lightnings, and Thunder Lance. Uh, 40 for each lightning to attach this Pokemon. Uh, Meridon, Togepi, Togetek, Toga Kiss. I like it because you can take one more prize card. We've already talked about that card. Miro, Azumarill, uh, Smoochum, Latios. Your base Pokemon play have no retreat cost. Pretty neat. It's a built in ability for no retreat cost. Pretty nice. Uh, could probably be flexed in some decks. We'll see how it works. Uh, Latios. You can see, so no Latios EX, just a Latios, and interesting. Uh, Siglyph, Yon Mask, Coffer, Gigas, Esper, uh, Meowstic, Sylveon EX. Sylveon is in a set, just randomly, for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, 160, during your opponent's next turn, attacks used by do 100 less, and choose two of your opponent's bench Pokemon, shuffle those Pokemon, no cards attached to it. Um, back to the deck, so you kind of disruption. It's a pretty bad card, uh, for what it's worth. Uh, or Corio, Sandy Goss, Apollo Sand, uh, 60, what 60 can't retreat? I think feel like this is a thing we've seen on Apollo Sand before. And Barit Gel, put damage counters on each of your opponent's bitch Pokemon until it has HP's 100. Uh, maybe you can combine it with like a Dusknord deck or something. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, Topu Lele, Indeedee, uh, Flittle, Espathra, Fluttermane, uh, move all damage counters from one of your bench and your Pokemon to your opponent's active Pokemon. Uh, Gimme Ghoul, uh, I think people like this because you can find two basic energy cards, sure. Uh, there's a Mankey, there's a Primate, there's an Anonlabe, Paldean Tauros, Fanfi, Donphan, Trapinch, Fabrava, Flygon! Uh, reversing Storm does 130, may switch Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon, which is nice because you switch into like maybe a Pokemon that can't be hurt, like maybe like Mimikyu or something like that. Uh, pretty neat. And Sonic Periodot, uh, the deck does 100 damage counters to each one of Pokemon EX and B Pokemon. It could be somewhat decent. Um, uh, yeah, it could be decent. It just, just like getting these things powered up is like the crazy thing, though. So we'll see. I do like Flygon. Flygon's one of my favorite Pokemon. So it's really cool to see Reversing Storm. Uh, that seems pretty nice as it is. Just be able to switch into another Pokemon. Good to go. Make it, make your opponent can take knockouts from like that. Ah, uh, Guy Stradion makes weird bitch. Uh, stage, po stage 2 Pokemon when your opponent's bench have no abilities, but it's only for the bench. So that's the big thing there. Uh, Dribbler, Axcadrill, Landorus, Passimian, Clob, Bob, Scrap Clock, Glimmit, Glamora, uh, Karida, Dino, as well as in Hydrogen, uh, Shrudel, Griffey, Alola Diglett, Duck Trio. Uh, both of these have no energies, but these are pretty bad. If you if you don't have exactly three cards in your hand, this deck does nothing. So 120 uh, for like a hard thing to set up every single turn. You need no energies, so that seems really bad. Uh, there's Archaeodon, um, EX, it has 300 HP. When you place Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may attach up two Metal Energy from just to your Pokemon anyone you like, and Metal Defender does 220 during your turn's next turn. This Pokemon has no weakness. So there we go, kind of powers of itself kind of thing. Uh, Golden Go around the skateboard, Iron Crown, Alolan Zekator. So we do have an Alolan Zekator, it turns out. Uh, Tropical Fantasy does 150, and uh, Swing and Sphine. Uh, flip a coin of heads, knock out your opponent's active base Pokemon to tails, knock out one of your opponent's bench based Pokemon. So you only knock out a bench or basic Pokemon in general. Altaria, Dialga, Palkia, Turtonator, Applin, Flapple, Apple Turn, Eternatus. Okay. Uh, Tatsugiri EX, let's go! There's an Eevee. H enough, I pulled two Sylveons in my packs, but no Eevees. This is pretty cool though, as long as Pokemon is your axe spot, it can evolve during your first turn or the turn it was played. Pretty neat that you can evolve into any of the, what the heck, into any of the EVs. Uh, Slacking EX, uh, 280, discard injury from this Pokemon, but if your opponent has no Pokemon EX or V Pokemon, this Pokemon can't attack. 280 for two energies is great, uh, but they have to have an EX or V in play, which I think most decks do, uh, so that's pretty easy to do. Uh, Swablu, Zangoose, Cacleon, uh, Bufflant, Rufflet, Breviary, Hollow Potential, Heliosk, Oranguru, Tandemouse, Mousehold, Blank card? Okay, Psykeyser. 
One thirty attack does thirty damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Um, that's a pretty bad card. Uh, Flamingo Precise Beak does thirty. If you, this Pokemon in your opponent's bench one, uh, so one thirty, you have exactly the same energies. And Brave Bird two hundred, pretty terrible. Uh, it's here because and we're finally to the trainer cards. There's an Able of Hope. And I don't know what a lot of these trainer cards do. I'll leave it about some of the Pokemon uh, trainer cards. I am definitely in the dark on these. Uh, Amulet Pope. If the Pokemon this card's attached to is knocked out by damage from attack, from your opponent's Pokemon, search it up for three cards and put them into your hand. Shelf your deck. Pretty cool. You can find any three cards to help set up if need be. Uh, but being able to also vacuum it off is pretty bad. Uh, Bibiri Berry takes 60 less from Metal Pokemon. Brilliant Blender. Search it for five cards and discard them. Shelf your deck. Pretty interesting, but that's it. I don't. What world we need to discard this? I maybe Ho Oh. That's the only thing I can think of. Maybe the the Cellarish deck could work. Uh, Call Bell. This is terrible. Uh, this is pretty bad. Uh, <laughs> the, the, because you have to go. You can only use card if you go on second and only during your first turn. You can only use card if you go on second and during your first turn. Those are these are terrible cards. Uh, Clement's Quick Whip. Heal 16 for each of your light Pokemon. 60 damage is irrelevant. Uh, you take 60 less from Dark Pokemon. Uh, Counter Gain is reprinted. Um, tax used by Pokemon is one less if your opponent has more or less prize cards than you. Uh, Kirino. Search for three Pokemon EX. Reveal them, put in your hand. Sure. Uh, deduction Kit. Look at the top three cards of your deck. Put them back into any order. Or shuffle them and put them bottom of your deck. This could be really good in Golden Go, right? Could be good. Could be good in Golden Go. Uh, Hail 6 damage from your active Dragon Pokemon. Pretty bad. Uh, Drasna, shuffle your head to the deck to the full point of hands. Draw 8. It tells draw 3. Bad. Uh, Drayton, look at the top 7 cards of your deck. Can be a real Pokemon and a trainer card you found there and put it in your hand. Bad. Dust Ball, look at the top 7. Look at the bottom 7 cards of your deck. Can be a real Pokemon you found there. And. Yeah, that's bad. Energy Search Pro. This is pretty itching. Search check for any number of basic energy cards. A different energy cards will really be put to your hand and then shuffle your deck. This could be pretty neat if you play multiple different energy types. Um, so, but as the e spec, that's the only big thing here. Um, stage two Pokemon play gets negative thirty HP. If you play like a basic only deck, it could be good. But I think those are the training cards, uh, stadium cards you rather play instead. Uh, all your opponents yeah, take thirty less damage. Okay, that's pretty bad. Uh, Lisa's Lisa's appeal. Switch in one of your opponent's bench base Pokemon to the X spot. If you do, the new Pokemon is now confused. Lively Stadium. Each base Pokemon play, both of your opponents get 30 more HP. That's pretty cool. Um, is it worth it? I don't know. I'm always scared to play training, uh, Stadium cards like that because they could get bumped. Your opponent counts cards in the deck. <sighs> sure. Uh, Megaton Blower. Discard all Pokemon tool and special from all your opponent's Pokemon and discarded state. Oh my goodness, that's so much. So you discard tools and special energy from all your opponent's Pokemon. Can you imagine playing this Lugia? Megaton Blower. Pff, destroy them all. That's funny. Uh, Miracle Headset. Put two Super Guards from Pokemon to your hand. Uh, it's like a Super VS Seeker. Once again, is it worth to play in this A spec? That's the question. I feel like anything, most things, just like Prime Catcher. Yeah, Prime Catcher is a billion percent better than most of these cards uh 60 less from water pokemon uh search for any of the basic pokemon and put them in your bench sure scramble switch it's an okay card it was okay back in the day it's going to be okay now move as many energy from your active to one of your bench pokemon and put them in the active spot it's going to be okay uh surfer switch your active with one of your bench pokemon if you do draw you have five cards in your hand another switch out i guess uh, technical machine fluorite discard all energy from the pokemon and heal all damage from all from each of your terror pokemon terror orb so check for terror pokemon villain put it in your hand i guess uh, i don't know no 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 time oh, yeah maybe one of maybe one of and like decks that play pidgeot maybe a one of maybe a one of yeah, that's too long for me to read. Enriching energy. As long as cards attached to Pokemon, it provides a colorless energy when you attach the card from your hand to your Pokemon. Draw four. Most special energy decks that use this. Yeah, I, no, there's no way. And we got a bunch of full art stuff, I think, at the end. Right? So, yeah, like I said, not too many that I missed, uh, that I talked about today. Nothing really, like, super crazy. The only super crazy card I can think of is Pikachu EX. 
Uh, yeah, these are just all gold and full arts of stuff. Uh, PKGX is probably the most craziest thing. Um, Celeridge. Is that the right card I'm thinking of? Char what is it called? Yeah, Celeridge seems kind of fun. Uh, Scovillian is neat, but I don't like you to build up damage counters, so that seems meh. Uh, Pikachu is like a cool one of card. I don't think it's like a super playable deck by itself. Uh, even a Lost Box, I think you're going to play with other cards as well. It's not going to be that. Uh, Flagon seems fun, but it definitely seems like gimmicky. And I think that's pretty much it. I've seen some people hype this card up, but sure. That's how I feel about it. Like, sure. A lot of the training cards are really bad, and even the Ace Packs are meh as bad you know as much i want to talk about um i think this set's definitely not defying anything new crazy like i don't think anything crazy is out of the set i definitely think this is like i'm going after pikachu and that's it so i definitely wouldn't recommend like buying packs of the set this set's pretty bad uh for what it's worth just to let y'all know i definitely wouldn't be buying packs of this uh but yeah if you haven't missed any cards let me know but i think i covered them all um from like from the barely of anything i know about surging sparks so that seems very bad but if i miss anything let me know i'm down to here um yeah so let's let me know guys hope you enjoyed the video quick recap i'm not gonna milk this um that's pretty much it we'll see you tomorrow uh i think we're gonna try to commentate a video we'll see how it works Alrighty, bye